Well, I'm back. Um, I've taken a different approach with this fighter as opposed to the last fighter. I'm upping up a lot of his endurance and stamina and movement stuff first. Mainly just endurance and stamina first. Just so I have the, the, the durability and the striking power. Because I've noticed that they gas out fairly quick. So if I can just kind of throw more punches, especially in, in these Ultimate Fighter... Um, Ultimate Fighter matches that maybe that can mean something better. Maybe I can just, right, guys, you know, just next, hammer on them. Three five, minute three, five minute rounds. Let's go. I don't even want to make it past the first. Let's just fight. This guy seems to be about the same height as I am. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Whoops. That's not what I wanted to do. Crap. Alright, cool. Oh man, he's putting in body work. He's putting in body work. Alright, I gotta back up. I gotta back up. Let's go. I took a risk thinking that if I punched him while he was on the ground that his head would keep the same amount of damage, but I guess it did take away some of his stamina if you kind of go back and watch it. Like it took away a large chunk of the stamina that he was able to accrue as I'm punching him in the face, but it didn't keep that damage in the head and I was just taking damage so how he was able to open up that cut. Because I just, I thought hey if I just keep punching maybe I can knock him out from this position. All the while he had a dominant position, more force in this power and he cut me up. But oh well, a win is a win, and we're making it on to the finals. And this time only took me one time. It didn't take me twice, so I feel just. <laughs> and again, with those kicks. I love the kicks. <laughs> me gustan las patadas mucho. <laughs> uh, so I'm in the finale, sweet. And technically this goes to the undercard or whatever, so it'll be another three round fight. Let's go. Let's do this. Next time you see Terran Yamamoto, we'll be in the finals. I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye.